requested nyo, which is the clean makeup look. So, brand dami sa inyo ang nagtatanong ng clean makeup look kasi I did it on TikTok. Post ako ng video on TikTok and hindi ko pinakita yung products doon kasi it was a really short video. So, sabi ko gagawin ko na lang ng video on YouTube and I asked you guys on Instagram if gusto nyo and a lot of you said yes. So we're gonna do it today. I'm gonna first start with prepping my skin. By the way, I was in Manila the other day and the pa lip filler sa ko. You guys will see the video later. Nung nasa Manila ako yung clips. Aso na pa ko video ng mismo ini inject yung filler sa lips ko. Bakal yung iba sa inyo very sensitive sa injection ganyan. And yung clips kasi is nandut pa sa mismo clinic kasi nag shoot din kami doon. So. Yeah, anyway, I'm just moisturizing my face. And zoom in ko lang kay ng konte para mas makita niya ng malinaw. So you can see the imperfections ng aking skin. Para hindi mo dry under eyes ko. Hindi ko na pinakita doon sa um, TikTok video yung skin prep. But since this is a YouTube video, ayan, magpapakita ko sa inyo ng buo. Next is I'm going to use a sunscreen. So this one is from Bella. This is their tinted sunscreen, the Sun Expert tinted sunscreen. This is how it looks like. It has a tone adapt technology, and it means na kahit ano skin tone mo, the product itself will adapt to your skin tone. So even if this only comes in one shade, it can be used kahit ano skin color mo. Ayan siya. This can also be a foundation substitute. So I apply ko siya sa skin ko like that. I like how this one cancels out redness. Kahit na hindi na ako mag foundation. Kasi as you can see, I have some redness there on my skin. And then I just blend it with a brush. Sometimes I just use my hands. Pero I also use a brush minsan. So you can clearly see naman na may difference na agad sila. And this one looks more brighter. And this side looks more glowy and healthy compared to this side. So this is why... I love using this product because I don't have foundation. Because I feel like it's too heavy on the skin. Kung gagamit pa ako ng foundation on a daily basis. Kaya hindi ako malis ng bahay. I still apply sunscreen. So ayon de ba kita agad na instantly na brighten up yung skin ko. And of course, do not forget the neck. So here is a close-up look of my skin right now without anything, just the sunscreen. Next is I'm going to apply a base or a primer on our skin. And this one just adds an extra glow on the skin. Next is I apply concealer. So luckily, wala akong pimples na yun. Or hindi sila ganun ka-obvious. But I have some spots na, oop, na need ko ng concealer. Then, I just blend everything. By the way, later on sa vlog na to, you will see me cooking kimchi rice. And nag-grocery din ako sa Korean store lang naman like a mini grocery lang kasi I suddenly crave for kimchi fried rice and I wanted to cook kimchi rice kasi it's been a while since I cooked my own like lagi ako nag order I use konti lang na concealer kasi I noticed na when I use a lot of concealer on my under eyes parang hindi ko bagay so I only use a bit enough to brighten up my under eyes and whatever is left on the brush I just use that on some areas. Next is I will do my eyebrows. Since I had my eyebrows microbladed, I don't really need to fill in my eyebrows ng sobra-sobra para mas madarken and madefine ng yung kilay ko. Since hindi na ako nakabalik for a retouch. Next is mag-apply tayo ng blush. You can use any blush that you want kung ano sa tingin mo yung flattering on your skin tone. Lately, I am obsessed with baby pink or light pink blushes. I feel ko din, mas nakaka-fresh lang yung light pink na color compared sa mga very rosy cheeks. Ganyan. Pero if that's what you think suits your skin color, go do it. Kasi sa makeup naman, wala naman tayong rules dito. So, ako nakatingin sa taas. Ginagawa ko sa siyang salamin. And then, I will now contour my face just a little bit. Ano lang, guys? Para lang may konting warmth yung face ko. So, I try to control the amount of 
bronzer I apply. Kasi ayoko naman ng masyadong bronzed. Ang skin ko. And then I also contour my nose. Pero light lang na contour. Para lang magkasunod ng shadow yung nose natin. You may skip this step if you would like. So next, it's time to set our face. And it's really important for me to set my face after doing my makeup or my base makeup because I have combination skin nga and if hindi ko to sinet, I will be oily on my T-zone and I don't want that. So this is the Bella Sun Expert Translucent Loose Powder. I've been using this product since last year. So actually, ito yung ginagamit ko right now. Bumili lang ako ng isa pa para at least my stock ako kasi nga ito yung lagi kong ginagamit like my go-to powder. Actually nawala na nga yung sponge nitong isa dahil lagi ko siyang gamit. That's why I use a brush na lang instead when applying it. Kapag bumili ka nito, kasama talaga siyang sponge and then may mirror na din siya. So very compact and you can bring this anywhere. I bring this one with me everywhere I go. So lapit lang sa inyo para mas makita nyo. It has a matte soft focus finish. It also has SPF 30, so it can protect our skin from the UV rays. That's why ito na lang yung dinadala ko, guys. Kasi hindi na ako makapag-reapply ng sunscreen. And you guys know naman na we need to reapply sunscreen throughout the day. Pero since I wear makeup most of the time, kapag umaalis ako, hindi na ako makapag-reapply ng sunscreen. Kasi kundi, mabubura yung makeup ko or gagalaw siya. Kaya ito na lang yung ginagamit ko since it also has SPF 30. So super easy na lang mag-reapply ng sunscreen. Kasi it's in a powder form. And another thing that I like about it is compared to my other powder. Kasi before, gumagamit din ako ng mga powder foundations to retouch throughout the day. And honestly, hindi ko siya nagustuhan. I mean, it's okay because it does help with mattifying my skin. Pero the more na nag -re apply ako throughout the day, whenever I get oily again, tapos mag -re apply ako ng mga powder foundation na yun, it becomes cakey. Nag-start na nun mag-cake sa skin ko. And I just don't like the appearance. Ito naman, kahit mag -re apply ako how many times a day, hindi siya nagi-cake on my skin. As in, hindi talaga siya nagi-cake. That's why I love using this. And it also helps because it doesn't crease under my eyes, which is one of my biggest problems because I have lines under my eyes. Though, minsan hindi may iwasan yung creasing, especially kung napadami yung apply ko ng concealer. Pero, if tama lang yung amount ng concealer and then I set it with this powder, no creasing at all talaga. So, even on my forehead, ayan, kita nyo, easily mattified with a soft focus finish. I love how it feels on my skin as well. It makes my skin feel really soft and smooth. And this product also has a tone adapt technology like the sunscreen or their tinted sunscreen. So it means na kahit isa lang yung shade na meron sila, it is suitable for any skin color. Kasi it will adapt to your skin color. It's talk free, hypoallergenic, and non-comedogenic. Kasi isa rin yun sa mga concerns ko. Kasi before, kapag gumagamit ako ng powder on my face, yung mga loose powder, nagkakaroon ako ng mga butlig-butlig sa skin. And hindi rin sila hypoallergenic. But this one, it's hypoallergenic and non-comedogenic, which means it won't clog your pores. Even when I am just indoors, I make sure to use this and this to protect my skin against the sun. Kasi may UV rays pa din and blue light that can affect our skin. Lalo na lagi tayo nakatutok sa mga gadgets natin. So applying sunscreen and reapplying sunscreen throughout the day is really, really important. By the way, this Bello Sun Expert Translucent Loose Powder is available on Shopee for only 450 pesos. Tapos may free ka ng 10ml nitong tinted sunscreen nila. And it's worth it guys kasi matagal nyo na siyang magagamit. Kahit araw-arawin nyo siyang gamitin, matagal nyo pa rin siyang magagamit. Next is I'm going to use a highlighter dito sa inner corner ng eyes ko. And this just helps to brighten up or open up my eyes more. Para magmukhang mas matangos yung nose natin. Again, this is all personal preference only. If hindi ko yung mahilig maglagay ng highlighter, it's totally fine. You can skip this step. I just personally like doing it. Apply lang ako ng lip tint. This is just a little, just a little bit, para lang gur ng color yung lips natin. I like this lip tint kasi hindi siya yung type ng lip tint na matte lang sa lips kanon. Parang it gives me a little bit of gloss, a little bit of shine. And then I will apply gloss lang on top. Yan. Oops. Yeah, 
yeah, that's basically how I achieved the clean makeup look. You can now set your face if you want. But since it's a bahay lang naman ako, hindi ko na iseset kasi sayang yung product. But ayan. I do this pretty much every single day nung na-discover ko siya. And I'm so happy kasi yung mga products na ginamit ko are very affordable lang. And itong dalawang to talaga nag-contribute to help me with my clean makeup look. Again, this is available on Shopee and also sa Bello mismo for only 450 pesos for the powder. And then you will get a 10ml version nitong tinted sunscreen. Diba? So, ano pang hinihintan nyo guys? Add to cart and check out na. <laughs> Okay, so for the rest of the vlog, it's just going to be yung trip ko sa Manila and nung nagluto ako ng kimchi rice and naggrocery ako. Actually, yung sa kimchi rice and yung paggrocery ko, it's like a few days ago. But yung sa Manila, it was actually the other day lang. So yun, I'll see you guys in a while. Main of people in my dreams The last time if 
Anesthesia na. So, like 30 to 45 minutes, yan ibababad sa lips para mag numb yung lips natin, guys. And gani chura niya. Don't mind this, guys. Nagpa adjust kasi on braces kahapon, tus nag dry yung labi ko habang ina open niya ng ganun. So, nasungat. So excited mga lip fillers. And I was planning to get the Ulthera for my double chin, which is a skin tightening machine. Pero, I think I'll do it on March na lang kasi mas okay daw if may sessions muna ng mesolipo which is yung pinapagawa ko before. So, kapag mesolipo ako around March right here and then sasabayan na lang siya ng Ulthera kapag tumagal-tagal but for now, ayan, ganyan pa rin yung double chin ko guys. <laughs> Malaki-laki pa din siya. I'm starting to feel my lips na nag- Meron? Meron? Wala. Guys, napagod lang ako. Wala. Wala naman ako nahanap ng sandals. Nahanap mo naman ako. Eh, yung five. Hindi pero wala ako nahanap guys. Nakakainis. Ang layo ng inilakad namin. Uy, malayo naman talaga. Dito kami eh. Saan ba ito? Ban ka ba? Dito sa Mayzara. Sa ano kami? Bonifacio Globe ay Bonifacio High Street. Oo nga, ito tayo galing kanina. Sa Bonifacio High Street. O dun din, pero dun sa kabila. Uh, so malayo nga. Malayo, malayo. O diba? So, you you. Pumaso kami sa Zara, pumaso kami sa Mango. Wala talaga ako mahanap guys. Ulitin ko ulit yung bahas ko sayang. Ha? Ulitin ko ulit. Kasi nahanap ang naman. <laughs> Hey guys, so it's been two days since I got my lip fillers. Actually, as you can see, we're still in the same um, exact spot. <laughs> Ganina nung ginawa ko yung clean makeup look. But yeah, I just want to give you guys an update on my lips. So this is how it looks like after two days. And I am so in love with it. Actually, hindi pa siya final. Um, this is done by Dr. XT of Belleza Aesthetics. And um, matagal ko na talaga silang nakikita. 
on TikTok and on Instagram and gusto gusto ko na talaga magpagawa ng lips ko kay Dr. X di sa Beliaza kasi ang ganda ng gawa niya guys very natural but luscious lips mm, look at that sobrang ganda sobrang natural but actually the thing is hindi pa yan tapos ha hindi pa yan tapos ang ginawa pa lang ni Dr. X di ay shinip niya yung lips ko but yung volume iya add niya pa this is how it looks like two days after ilagay yung fillers and I think hindi man kami na ngalahate sa buong syringe and ginamit niya ay Restylane. Restylane? I don't know how to pronounce it. Pero, yun yung ginamit niyang filler sa akin. And, sobrang ganda. Lalo na pag naka-gloss, hindi ko, hindi ko maalas yung tingin ko sa lips ko. So, hindi siya namaga. Kasi, I was expecting it na mamaga. Pero, I'm glad that it did it. Kasi, at least, nakapag-selfie na ako agad. <laughs> so, yeah, thank you so much again to Dr. XT. And, of course, to Beleza Aesthetics for my lips. Super, super ganda. And, I can't wait to go back. So, yun. Pasensya na rin, guys, kung dun sa kanina sa vlog ko sa Manila. Hindi ako masyado nakapag-vlog doon. Kasi, I don't know, medyo nahihiya ako mag-vlog doon dahil sobrang daming tao. And, I don't know. But, yeah. Wala din naman ako masyadong ginawa. Talagang pumunta ako doon for my lip fillers. And then, we just went to BGC to eat lunch. And, ayun, nagtingin-tingin sa mga um, shops. Pero, wala ako nahanapan na store na may mga magagandang sandals. Like, inikot na namin yung Mango, yung Zara, yung Birkenstock pero wala akong nagustuhan so yeah that's why I wasn't able to vlog then there a lot but anyway hope you guys enjoyed this video again all the product links will be in the description box thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video hi guys walking downtown and I'm okay He's got it all figured out